I like to be in control, um, and there it is. You know what's really great about all these shows? Have it they have a look at them and go, wow, they come with this is actually... I mean, very, actually, I, and that's another interesting point that you raised, because when you've been on the air for a while, how do you keep the show fresh? You know, and Phil, that's got to be an issue on your show. Well, I, I do feel that we have, we, we do have a secret ingredient in the sense that we have the world to choose from. So we've been to India, for instance, 10 times. We could go to India 100 times and we still wouldn't use up all the opportunities that India has to offer. So you will never see the same background on our show. Every time you look at our show, what's behind the contestants and where they are is always different. You can't say that about every show. I mean, shows that are, that are on a, uh, like a variety type show where they're on a stage, maybe change the lights and the dressing and the background, but essentially you've got new faces behind sometimes the same places. We have a show where we have the luxury, even 24 seasons in, to have new faces in front of new places. And that helps to keep our show fresh because honestly, I would not be able to have been on this show 24 seasons just from a personal standpoint and stay excited and want to get out and go and shoot this. Because on a personal level and for those of us working on the show, we're like, look where we are, look what we're doing, and look at this opportunity we get to give to these people and then consequently share with an audience. In case you all didn't hear, that was 24 seasons. Yes. Okay, Good 24 time. seasons. Just amazing. Sure. Yeah. Yeah, right. uh, I didn't mean, I'm sorry. I, I, I've lost count. <laughs> Somebody said, you've been doing that show for 24 years? Yeah. Like, no, 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 24 seasons. Right. Well, 24 cycles. Yeah. Yes. Right? 24 yeah. cycles. No, no, you didn't say that. I'm saying sometimes people say, wow. Right. right. Yeah. Uh, RuPaul, your thoughts on this, on keeping something fresh when people, especially because all of your shows have fans specific to, to the show, people who are like addicts about the show people who talk about the show on social media, people who are sharing things. But for those people, those are the people, the very ones who you have to keep it fresh for because those are the people who have seen the most, experienced the most, and are most familiar with the format. So, so how do you do that? Oh, I don't know if you know, but all the producers on our show are gay. <laughs> so, sorry about it. Um, we're very, very creative people. So, you know, and we draw from the, the vast history of not only the gay experience, but the outsider experience, the people who dance to the beat of a different drummer. And, you know, our show is, it showcases the art of drag, which is really about really mocking everything. So everything's up for grabs. And so, you know, you, you, you take on any subject, you add drag to it, and it's hilarious <laughs> and interesting because it, it takes on a different texture. And you go, oh, my goodness. Oh, look at that it, through the, these eyes, you know. And our show, RuPaul's Drag Race, at its core, is really about the tenacity of the human spirit. And how interesting is that? <laughs> the human spirit. Let's make a show we about it. We love, we love that. Human spirit. I think that's why the audience tunes in. Jane, your, your, your thoughts about keeping things. Well, we, we, you know, we have this crack team of um, uh, 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 game uh, creators, and so every, we've, we're now in our, go, hopefully going into our third season, and um, I'm sure we'll have ten more games, but um, the, we, we'd like to do, make the games as simple, but also a little bit challenging, but uh, not to go outside of the reference level of, um, we don't want to go into Dostoevsky or Shakespeare. We kind of want to stay in People magazine and Us Weekly, and um, in that way we ha end up having a lot of fun. But I mean, it can be challenging. They've, some of the games are challenging, like, some, like the, the music games I could never play. I am not up on my Beyonce or my Rihanna. I don't even know, what, how do you pronounce her name? <laughs> Rihanna. Rihanna, <laughs> and she's beautiful and has a gorgeous But Rihanna is also lovely. Yes. Have you heard Viana's latest? Yeah, no, <laughs> it's really lovely. Well, that's good to know. Yeah, um, yeah so I, you know, it's keeping the games fresh so that people um, you know, aren't are, are watching the same thing over and over again. But I think the key to the show being exciting is that we, the celebrities and how much fun they have. And what's great about having the civilians on the show is that by the end of the, the night, you forget who the celebrity is and who the civilian is, and everybody's just having fun.